Hey friends, so today I want to talk about what to do on the weekends and eating out at restaurants. Weekends are hard. They're really hard for me because my fiance loves to go out to eat. He works in the food industry and is always doing stuff and now he's just really busy all the time and so he just loves going out to eat. I grew up not liking going out to eat. I always ate home cooked meals. So I struggle with this a lot because when you go to restaurants, even if you choose healthy foods, I know that they can still have a lot of salt and you know who knows what they're cooking it in. So some of my top tips for eating at restaurants are to order, if you are gonna order a salad, stay away from having dressing on the salad Stay away from croutons. <laughs> you want it to mostly just be vegetables with the protein. I did find a really good salad at Hulahan's. It's like my favorite cheat meal, but it just has kale and spinach and chicken, and then it has berries and some goat cheese on it, and I think some slivered almonds or something. I don't remember, but it's really, really good. So if you are going to have cheese on your salad and you're not sensitive to dairy, then make sure that you could ask for it on the side or just ask for a little bit because sometimes they can load those things up with cheese. So no dressing, no cheese, or just a little bit of cheese, but like I said, stick to lots of vegetables. Another thing I like to eat when I'm eating out at restaurants are turkey burgers. I usually have them in a lettuce wrap, and if that's not an option, I'll just take the bun off as soon as it comes to me. So that's an option as well. But you really want to think protein and lean vegetables. Now if you're doing the 21 day fix, it's up to you if you want to bring your containers. I have known some of my friends who have brought containers to restaurants to measure the portions. Another tip that I recommend if you don't want to do that is just know our portions are always huge. So try to eat half. Ask them to take half of it away in the beginning if you need to. But that's a tip that I do for portions. I usually don't bring my containers from doing the 21 day fix so many times I can see what's a huge portion and what's not. So just be realistic about it. Don't beat yourself up if you do go off track. Drink tons of water, especially on the weekends. I think during the week you get in your routine and so it's easy to drink lots of water, but on the weekends it gets a little trickier. So, you know, make sure that you're still drinking your water, you're still getting your workouts in. The weekends are still, if you count Friday, three of the seven days of the week, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So you don't want to go off track for three whole days. And one more tip, I personally struggle with cheat meals. I find that sometimes it throws me off, like crazy throws me off. Like I was, I would have a piece of pizza and then I would just want to keep eating. So sometimes your cheat meal might not be that elaborate. If you find that it is really derailing you and distracting you, then just stick to the plan and your cheat meal, like I said, can be that salad, but make it have a little extra goat cheese or whatever. You know, you have to know yourself and know your relationship with food and know what results you're trying to get. So I can give you suggestions, but it's really on you to make the changes and to make the difference. So I hope this helps with going out to eat tips and some tips for the weekend. And I will talk to you all soon. Thanks for watching.